What's up, fam? It's your boy Black Cat. You're back, Cat. Another short video. This video's gonna be about black abuse. Now, if you ask somebody a question, especially now, I don't know about this generation now, but the old generation, you ask them, "How was you punished? Um, did you get beatings and things like that?" A lot of people go come out there and say, "Yeah, I was get beat with um, sticks, extension cords, hangers, and crazy shit like that." But now they try to act like um, it was normal, like it's, it's some, some kind of form of punishment that it's okay. That shit is not okay, family. That is not okay. You was abused. You was abused. If your mama got picked up a fucking extension cord, and to my um, one dude told my mother, maybe getting a shower, getting wet, and the beauty of a fucking extension cord, then your fucking mother got fucking problems, psychological problems, and she need fucking being in Bellevue Hospital, some psychiatric hospital, some shit. Because there's no way in the world that I would beat my kid with an extension cord. One dude said he got beat with a bat. What kind of shit is this in? It's like, it's fucking normal. Like, yeah, like, yeah, I got bat. I used to get beat with bats. I used to get beat with extension cords. Nah, you was fucking abused and that shit is fucking wrong. Damn sure wrong. No, I have a son, you know. And, um, I have never had to beat my son or whip him. Or you might have, you might have t a little tap on the hand. He do something as a little kid and show him that that's wrong. But for to sit there and pull extension cord on my kid or a fucking baseball bat, or some fucking some object to whip my kid, that's just fucking un unthinkable, you know. And especially if a kid is doing bad things like that, dear. You say, oh, the mom can't hand control him. Then the parent has a problem. That means she can't control her. her uh, her son or daughter. So they, they are the damn problem. Not that kid. You know. That's like watching little kids inside department stores. Going crazy. Going frantic. Going just yelling and screaming. Ah. Doing the hell they want. Why they do that? Because their parents have no kind of. No power over them. You see a regular little kid inside there. He's he's, he's real obedient. He does what his parents tell him to do. That means that's good parenting. Sometimes in some cases. You have some kids who have some kind of. Mental problems. Then okay, that's something different. That's why the kid's acting up like that. But for an average kid out there, you know, he don't deserve no kind of weapons like that. No extension cord sticks, fucking rocks. Like, what the fuck is this? The goddamn caveman days? You beating your kids? Anything you could grab with him? You grab? You can grab just to hurt him? Cause that's what you do. You're doing. You're hurting them. You're not just hurting them physically. You're hurting them mentally. And now. 20 years later, he's sitting there telling him, yeah, I just get beaten and act like it's fucking normal. No, you was abused. Your parents abused you and was fucking wrong. There's nothing right about that shit, dear. So, parents out there nowadays, please, talk to your kids. Set them down. You got to start when fucking young. You can't wait till that kid's got them 13, 14 years old. They want to put your foot down. Tell them, oh, I want you in the house at 9 o'clock. This little mo, he's outside smoking weed, doing the fake one, dude. He's, it's too late then. You got to take them kids as young, so they come out. You know, let them know who's the mother, who's the father. Stop being friends to these kids. That's another damn thing you see that's um messing the community up. Because they're not having no more respect for um, elders. Why? Because they have no respect at home for their parents. He can walk to the goddamn door and call his mother, for example. Hey, Darlene. Pops not in the house, or it pops maybe somewhere. It might call him, "Hey Joe, what kind of shit is that, dear? You are the mother, you are the father, but most likely these, these women are raising kids up by themselves. But that's still no excuse. But I was raised by a grandmother. My grandmother raised me and my brother, and it was still you. You had discipline." She had to beat us with no goddamn sticks and fucking extension cords and rocks and all this crazy ass shit, you know. It's discipline. You, it's respect. These little kids have no respect nowadays. They can do what they want to do. Why? Because their parents are like friends to them. They come home, smoke weed with them, drink, curse in the house. Do anything that they goddamn want to do. Bring a pussy in the house. The little girls bring a dick in the house. They fucking, they do whatever the hell they want to do in the house. Parents, that's your house. You pay the rent. You pay the bills in that damn house. 